there's not really, there's not really a whole lot to say. There's this phrase that keeps running over and over in my mind. Failure. Apparently it's the best teacher that you can have, but I've had 10 failures against somebody who I used to look at as a brother. I told you, Jay, I told you I'd give you everything I had. I even brought some new tricks out of the bag. But it beat me fair and square, one, two, three, Jay. So I gotta say it. Tonight, you're the better man. Tonight, you beat me by that much. And I'm gonna put that down to the fact that this is my first singles titles match. This is my first main event all by myself. That one, Jay, came down to experience. But I, I told you, I told you, I'm never done fighting you. You asked who's next, Jay? You asked who's next? Well, damn it, Jay. If you're not busy, I'll take you on again, and again, and again! until I take that off of you. <laughs> oh, what else do I really need to say? I just said what I needed to in that ring. David Finney, I've been saying it all along, especially since my return to New Japan. You are not on my level, sadly, and it's okay. Because not a lot of people, not many, if any, there's a scribe quote, New Zealand rap, not many, if any, are on my level. I'm gonna keep climbing in every way possible in that ring. I'm gonna take out everyone. I've said it since I got here. But that's something I find interesting. Saying things. You say one thing because you said it. People think you must be telling the truth. That must be what's going on inside his head. Because he said it. How do you know I'm not just saying something to make you think what I'm saying? Then again, how do you not know that I'm saying this now? So you think that what I said, you, said to you in the first place wasn't actually true. And this is. But then again, I could be saying this to trick you into thinking that what I said the first time and you thought it was that, but I made you think that. Maybe it's not that. Think about it.